Well, you know, it was the end of about two and a half weeks on the road. <laughs> and, you know, I think we've been in Charlotte a total of like three days in two and a half weeks. And, and that's challenging, you know, uh, not complaining about it. Uh, we actually uh, played pretty well in conference play and went three and three, you know, winning twice at FAU and then, you know, winning one game at middle and had a, a chance to win the other two games, you know, at middle. Uh, just didn't quite get it done on Friday night and, and didn't quite uh, play the way we wanted to on Sunday. But uh, to be able to do that, uh, didn't play as well as we wanted to on Tuesday. Got some guys banged up, got some guys a little fatigued, um, but we're going to get it figured out. We had a really good practice yesterday. Really proud of our guys for showing up and getting work done. And we just need to apply it in a game situation now. Well, they keep getting better. You know, they've been in the league for a long time. Uh, they're going to run out good arms, you know, on the weekend. Uh, they, they've beaten, you know, they beat Southern Miss. Uh, they beat FAU. Uh, you know, they, they play a very competitive non-conference schedule like just about everybody in our league does. Uh, so we're going to have another challenge. And, you know, I was, I was at the Foundation Golf Tournament on Monday, which was a good uh, good time for me. Enjoy, you know, interacting with all of our boosters and the people that really support our athletic department here and our scholarship program. And, you know, was telling a couple of guys I was playing golf with that, you know, we're only halfway through our regular season. They're kind of looking at me like, what? You know, and I said, no, we still got 15 conference games left. And, and we take that as, uh, as a positive. You know, we got a chance to be able to to be able to play 15 games against elite level competition and, and make some more adjustments and, and try to position ourselves uh, to get in the conference tournament and play beyond the conference tournament. Well, I just talked, Derek Galello's down here, you know, getting his workout in right now because he's in grad school and, 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 and Bo and, and I have been, been trying to help Derek get his workout in today since he can't be at practice later on this afternoon. Um, and one of the things he said is, you know, coach, we just need to have every guy do their job the right way, which is true. The old Bill Belichick, you know, line. Everybody do their job, uh, and then the second thing is just trying to find that consistency. I mean, we've shown that we can beat really good teams, and we can beat really good teams on the road, and we can beat good teams, you know, in other environments. It's just a matter of being consistent. And I think that, you know, we just got to play every pitch, every inning, every game, every day, value every opportunity that we can. And I know I'm kind of giving a general, uh, broad-based response here, but that's that's really what we're trying to emphasize with guys. We're going to do. Uh, some things in practice today to kind of break a few guys down individually and try to help them and, and then be ready to go on Friday.